as we already know, Isaac model usually uses plus one and minus one value for the qubits. However, it is not useful for the commercial purpose. The commercial market uses binary number 0 and 1 for the computer science, so that's why we have the Kibo for binary value solver for Ising model. So today we'll be talking about the Kibo matrix. Now we are going to solve a cost function to minimize the total cost function. This is the equation for the cost function. Here E is the cost function, Q0 and Q1 is qubits and Kibo has the value of 0 and 1 for qubits. In order to solve Kibo, we have to prepare Kibo matrix to put the coefficient of the equation on the matrix. So we have to put the coefficient of each qubits on diagonal element and interaction on the off diagonal element. Now we are going to continue by using BlueCat in Google Colab. Before that, we shall be doing the coding in the Google Colab. First, we need to install BlueCat. In order to do that, type in exclamation mark pip install BlueCat in Google Colab. Now let's do it in the Google Colab. Type in exclamation mark pip install BlueCat. Run this. We can see that the BlueCat gets installed. So we'll be importing opt module from BlueCat to solve the optimization problem. There are several solutions with regard to the Kibo matrix. Solution 1 is to put the Kibo matrix in the solver. This is the solver. When we run this in Google Colab, we'll get this output. Let's try it out in the Google Colab. Run this. We can see that we have the same output. Solution 2 is much easier. Just put the cost function directly. This is the cost function. When we run this in Google Colab, we'll get this output. Let's try it out in the Google Colab. Run this. We can see that we have the same output. Solution 3 is to use the simulation of the state vector with QAOA algorithm. Quantum approximation optimization algorithm can help calculate the best combination from many possibilities. So we print this with QAOA algorithm. When we run this in Google Colab, we'll get this output. Let's try it out in the Google Colab. Run this. We can see that we have the same output. This is the examples to solve the Kibo matrix. Thank you for watching this video and hope to see you next time.